Welcome to Avateer. With the Avateer password management solution, one of the features is the ability for a user to test a new password without fear of locking out or disabling their account. One of the hurdles we encounter in our environments with the user community is the myth that coming up with a new complex password is difficult. This myth stems from a history of using the normal password reset functionality in Microsoft Windows and getting a cryptic response of, the password you entered does not meet the complexity requirements of the domain. For some of our users, this adds to their confusion and frustration when coming up with a new password. For this demonstration, we will walk through the process of using Password Station's functionality of testing a new password and providing a clear response to the user. From the Password Station webpage, we simply click on the Test Password icon to begin the process. In doing so, we are taken to the Test New Password screen. This self-service tool is a feature of Password Bouncer one of the components of the Avatir password management solution. With this tool, we have the option to not only test a new password for use on an Active Directory domain, but also to test passwords for other applications that may have a different password policy. By selecting DC from the drop-down list, we can test a password against the policy on a domain controller. Doing so updates the screen to include the name of the domain and a blank to enter a new potential password for our account. When entering a password for testing, you will note that we have enabled the option to not mask what we are entering. This allows the user to see what they are typing and help them to retain the complex password they are about to use. First, for this demonstration, I will use a password of password to show how the Avatir password management solution provides clear feedback to a user when a non-compliant password is entered. After entering password in the blank, I click on Test Password to test it against the policy. In this case, we can see that the password fails the policy check, stating that mixed case was not used, we need at least one number to be part of the password, and the word password is actually in the dictionary and we're not allowed to use that in our password. If I update the new password field to reflect a complex password, and then click the Test Password button, it will do a check against the policy once again and we'll see that it is successful this time. No password change is actually done here as it is only a policy verification. To change our password we would select done and then select either the change password or forgot password buttons to then reset our password to our new one. 